All right, so I want to go over some tips on how to make Spanish That Works work for you. In the preface to the student are some hints and suggestions. The first is to follow the rules. Although Spanish That Works doesn't emphasize grammar rules and structures, the speaking exercises produce the best results when you follow the method outlined in the course. The next is to have patience and dedication. Learning a language takes time and fluency builds gradually, so just be patient with yourself. If you don't get it at first, just repeat, repeat, repeat until it becomes natural. The next is to keep a sense of humor. Don't worry about being perfect or getting it all right. Mistakes are part of the fun of learning a new language. And try to think of funny things to help you remember. The next suggestion is to use the pronunciation guide in the course. The guide is written for American English speakers, and it's designed to approximate the sounds of Spanish. Even if you think you already know how to pronounce Spanish, I bet that there are some things that you didn't learn if you learned Spanish in a school environment. There are probably some things in your pronunciation that you could change to make better, and the pronunciation guide can help you with that. The guide doesn't make sense to most Spanish speakers, especially if they don't speak English well, so don't expect them to understand it. It's written for the student. If you are a speaker of another language, you may have to adapt the guide to fit you because it was written for English speakers. Just listen and write out how it sounds to you. Since this is a course in conversation, it's more important that you learn how to understand and say the words than to know how to spell them at first. Spanish is actually phonetic in spelling, so if you learn how to hear and say things, then later on you can learn how to spell them just fine. So if you're having trouble saying a word with the correct pronunciation, just use the pronunciation guide until you anchor in how those letters are pronounced. If you have difficulties with a Spanish word, it's probably because an English word is getting in the way. Just use the pronunciation guide. It will be helpful if you have someone with a native or excellent pronunciation of Spanish listen to you as you say the words. This way you'll get feedback. This is especially important if you're learning on your own.